In this guitar video, I'm going to show you how to do a 6-string sweep and a 7-string sweep. Um, but just a word of advice, if you don't know how to do 5 or 4 string sweeps, uh, don't. I mean, you can attempt these, but they're going to be kind of confusing because they're not going to match up the shapes and everything. So, anyways, um, the first one I'm going to show you is a major scale sweep. And... Uh, it's going to be starting at the 5th fret on the E string. This is a 6 string sweep, so it's going to be 5th fret on the E string. And then it's going to be the ninth fret on the E string. So, And that's the first uh, two notes of the sequence. So it's... And then 7th seventh, uh, seventh fret on the... A string, so, and then you're gonna do the little roll that you commonly do in sweep, so, and it's gonna be the seventh fret on the D string, so, so far we have, and after that we're going to do the sixth fret on the G string, so, and after that we're going to do the uh, fifth fret on the B string. So, and then fifth fret on the E string again. So, and you want to kind of be careful not to get that kind of effect. Just, and then to finish off the sweep, you're going to. Uh, hammer on and pull off on the ninth fret on the E string, so, so, sorry, so yeah, and don't do it fast or else it sounds like poop, and sorry if mine sound like poop, just practice it slow and sort of build it up. Um, and then the first seventh string uh, sweep I'm going to teach you is also a major uh, uh, sweep. It's a in a major scale. Um, this is also going to be on the fifth fret just because that's easier. But um, it's going to start on the fifth fret on your low B and it's going to be uh, five, seven, which is just like how those six string ones started off. So basically, it started off like you're doing a six string sweep on a seven string. So it's going to be five, seven, and then five on the E string, then five on the A string, and then uh, six on the D string. So and then four on the G string. Five on the B string, so and then it's going to be five or back to four on the E string, so and then hammer on to seven on the E string and pull, and then just go back up. found the lesson useful.